Um, now that you've got all, all of these things, for instance, the taskbar um, and the windows like this, except the icons there on the left, uh, I'll show you that later. Uh, the next thing you want to do is get Rocket Dock. It's a really nice dock and I'll put the link in the description. You want to go here, I'll put this link. You want to download it, then install it, run it, uh, and then uh, it won't look like this yet. It won't look like this yet. Um, uh, the screen position, first of all, should be bottom. And then you want to download the Mac OS X Leopard skin. I'll put the link in the description again. <laughs> download it. Uh, then you want to extract it um, where you put your rocket dock see there's this skins you wanna put it in skins I already have it here you just wanna drag and drag it in skins um, then you should uh, restart rocket dock go to dock settings uh, was it um, yeah put style theme and scroll down and see Mac OS X Leopard. Yeah. So then you probably want to get the cursors I have. Um, well, actually, you've already got them. Um, remember, we downloaded the Zayas OS X uh, something something something. So you want to go into personalization. Um, mouse pointers. I already have it. But you change, uh, choose none and browse then you wanna go into mm, the place where you extracted all of these here it is uh, y then you wanna press OS X cursors if you chose the first one and click browse you wanna use normal select open it then help select exactly the same thing second one open it now working in background there's lots of different versions one is this aqua blob um, another is called the busy graphite but the real mac one is actually this one this is the real mac one but the others are nice as well so this will basically um, swirl around like this then busy you wanna uh, there's also different kinds but the Mac one is this one just busy um, and yeah all of the others are there too uh, then you wanna save it as and Mac OS X of course apply it as well mm. then you probably wanna get uh, the screensaver for Mac for Mac it's really nice and uh, actually I really like it to get this I'll put the link in the description you're gonna go to thi this site and click download over here then then uh, you wanna extract it wherever you like no, actually you wanna extract it in the Windows folder Copy to Windows. Continue. Continue. Then you want to right click and install. Run. Then it opens up the screensaver tab. You can choose your screensaver and choose the flurry and apply now we got the Mac screensaver as well it's really nice um, now there's one more thing you wanna get uh, actually I hope there would be two more but 
unfortunately I couldn't find a working download link for Left Sider. But if you can find it, it's essentially a program that puts your minimize, maximize and close button in the reverse order and on the left. Um, but the program, the last program I'm going to show you is called Switcher. It allows me to do this. Basically, it changes changes the old tab behavior, and I use it quite a lot. Um, I'll put the link in the description. Um, so you wanna download it? I've got it downloaded already, y and you wanna install it. And to be honest, that's basically it. Uh, if you followed my tutorial, um, your desktop and everything should look like this. I hope you enjoyed and um, subscribe, like, comment and as a wise poet once put it, giggity 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 goo, stick around.